Jason Boyd from Crystal Clinic, back to answer another one of the web's most searched questions, which is, does my rotator cuff need surgery? And while that's a nuanced question, here are three characteristics that will increase the likelihood of requiring surgery after a rotator cuff tear. The first has to do with your MRI. If your MRI shows a full thickness rotator cuff, meaning the tendon has torn completely away from the bone, that's gonna increase the likelihood of requiring surgery to fix it. The second has to do with trauma. If you had a completely normal shoulder and now have a rotator cuff tear after suffering a fall or some other injury, that will also increase the likelihood of requiring surgery to fix it. And the last has to do with time and treatment. If it has been over six or eight weeks from your injury and you've been treating with physical therapy, anti-inflammatories, and possibly a steroid injection, but you're still not better, that would also indicate that you may need surgery to fix your problem. Hope you found these three pointers helpful. Let us know what other shoulder or rotator cuff questions you have down in the comments below. Be sure to visit us on crystalclinic.com and we'll see you in the next one.